Hello everybody, it's Bonnie from Bonnie's Pretty Poppet Doll Nursery. How is everybody on this beautiful Saturday but chilly day? I hope you've been able to spend some time with those that you love, accomplish a few things you set out to do, and I certainly hope that you've had a chance to laugh and play and joke and be yourself. Well, today I have my beautiful newest Pretty Poppet with us, and this is darling little Penny Lane, who of course was named after the Beatles song, Penny Lane, um, and she is the winter sculpt by Laura Tuzio Ross, and her artist is Barb Wilson from Barb's Baby Dolls, and Barb has also done my Scotland Nell, which is my Laura sculpt, and she also has done Truvy Hope, which is my Jupiter sculpt. <laughs> So we have uh, had a few of Laura's, ba uh, I'm sorry, Barb's babies, and they are just darling, and she does such a wonderful job. So we're going to do two tags today, and the first one is from Chris's Cuddles, and that's Chris, of course. Chris has um, a beautiful channel. She has gorgeous babies. I just love her baby, Oliver. All of her babies, but Oliver is one of my favorites, and she has beautiful clothes and she changes the babies and I enjoy her chats very much. I'm sure you've seen her channel, but if you haven't, pop over there and see Chris. She is doing a sleeper week, so we're going to change little Penny Lane into this darling little sleeper. It's a, like a, a hmm, I want to say coral, or, hmm, peachy color. <laughs> oh, there, that's a good one. It has little floral prints on it with uh, mint green, cream colored, and some cranberry. It's just a really pretty color. It has a cute little cream colored bow. It has feet, and of course it's long sleeved. It is a Carter's, and it's a zero to three months. Oh, I noticed as a, it has a few bows down the front. Really sweet. I'm gonna put on a pair of socks to hold her feet in place and then we're just going to do this pretty white Emma Ellie bow. It is white. It's showing up a little bit green but I guess that's okay because there is a little bit of green in here but it is white. This is part of the outfit that she came in. Look how darling she is. She has beautiful blue glass eyes and of course I love her hands. Let's take off her little shoes. These shoes came with her for those of you, the box opening was yesterday, so if you'd like to see her box opening and you haven't yet, you can uh, go to my very last one before this one, and that is Penny Lane's box opening. One thing I noticed I forgot was a t-shirt. I usually like to keep a t-shirt on them to protect their bodies, but I didn't bring one so I'm going to just put it on for now, and then I'll get a t-shirt for her later. Um, but she is darling. She's painted beautifully. Barb did a wonderful job. I love her hair. It's just so cute. And uh, so we are doing that today. Oh, my God. Look at those cute little ears. Oh, you are just so precious. I did look it up. She's five pounds and 12 ounces um so she's a good size baby but she's little in the fat i hope this is going to fit her actually now that i'm looking at it, it looks a little bit big but that's okay sleepers can be baggy and comfortable can't they this is a darling little diaper it has uh strawberries dipped in chocolate on it i'm not going to change that because i can see that it was just put on her recently I have a question for everybody and I have both and I really have different reasons for liking it but are you more fond of painted hair or rooted hair or doesn't it matter uh, do you only have one type of doll I'm gonna make her disappear for just a minute hello darling hello little penny lane there you go back to see your aunties and uncles and cousins um so my question to you is do you enjoy painted babies rooted babies i have both and i have different reasons for liking both but i don't know if i actually have a favorite 
I think rooted here is more realistic, but it gives me more worries. I have to worry about making sure it's combed properly for the camera. I also have to, um, you know, make sure that you put the baby on satin. For those of you who didn't know or are new to the hobby, uh, I always lay my rooted babies on some sort of satin pillowcase or something because it is supposed to help um, with the hair not being pulled out. Um, so I worry about it a lot, but I do think the baby looks more realistic with painted hair. This is going to fit her just fine. Um, so I, that's one of the reasons why I like rooted hair for realism. But I love the painted hair because you don't have to deal with it at all. Uh, you can put hats and bows and not worry. You can uh, bring the baby on camera and not worry that her hair looks crazy and I'll fly away. Um, so I don't know. Do you have a favorite? And if so, which is it? Or like me, can you not decide? Do you have certain reasons for wanting certain kinds? This little outfit is so cute. It's so cozy, too. It is ribbed. It's a little bit big in the collar, but we won't worry about that. Look how darling she looks. She looking at you? Yeah. This blanket, I didn't realize, matches so well that it's hard to see. All right. And we're going to put this cute little white bow on her hair. She's such a pretty girl. Let me bring her a little bit closer so you can see this outfit. I didn't realize that the blanket was so much the same color. And then for the second tag we're going to do today, we're going to do Auntie Patricia over at Patricia's Dolly Dreams tag. And it's play day Saturday because today is Saturday. And we have this cute little bunny. And we have this cute little carrot. I don't know sure if she likes it or not, but like, like, like that in her face. But we're going to play with those and spend some time together moving our legs and playing patty cake. So we're doing Play Day Saturday from Patricia over at Patricia's Dolly's Dreams, a very beautiful channel also. Please pop in and see Patricia and tell her we said hello. I hope you have a wonderful weekend. Again, if you'd like to let me know what you're going to do this weekend. I have some meat marinating right now, and then we're going to head to the butcher later. And the butcher happens to be in the indoor flea market. So, of course, we're going to look in the indoor flea market. And then uh, we're going to come home, and on Sunday is going to be our prep day for cleaning, laundry, and all that fun stuff. So please let me know what you're up to this weekend. I'd love to know. I hope everyone's in good health. If you're at work, please come home safe to those who love you. And if you're at home, I know you're busy, but please take some part of your day to put your feet up, relax, pamper yourself, and don't forget to eat chocolate. Darling little Penny Lane, myself, and all of the pretty puppets send you love and hugs. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you for being so supportive and your wonderful comments. God bless you, and we will see you real soon.